Hello guys, welcome to Millionaire by 25. Today I will be showing you how to use Facebook to get traffic and sales for your gig on Fiverr. Don't forget to like, subscribe, click on the notification bell icon so you can be notified when we drop a video. The course will start right after the intro. Welcome back guys. So, like I said, today I will be showing you how to use Facebook to get traffic and sales. Like you're looking for clients, people who would patronize your gig. Um, Facebook is one place you can you know, take advantage. And uh, as a first time um, user on Fiverr, uh, yeah, I already told you how you could get your uh first five star and subsequent five star on fiverr and now the next thing you need to look at is how to get clients people who would patronize you now a lot of persons make mistakes by going to fiverr uh, pages uh, fiverr groups to advertise but one thing you need to know is that everybody here on this fiverr promotion review exchange page and the rest everybody here are all sellers they all sell gig they have one or two gigs to sell you barely will find a buyer here so when you come here to advertise your gig you are wasting your time a lot of people make that mistake you can only find a gig exchange here you want to exchange your um uh review gig review you want to you know get reviews from others and you give them review in return outside that this is not the best place to go to so first you would need to search for uh people who who really need your service now you don't go to an existing company yeah it might work maybe out of a hundred percent you might have 10% work for you, but I believe an existing company, uh, company product services or brands that have been running for uh, a while now should have most of the services uh, given to them. For instance, if you're a website designer, they should have their website. If you're a graphics designer, they should have gotten someone to uh, set up their graphics and the rest. So what you should be targeting are uh startup business groups that's what you should be looking at so you can go to the facebook uh search and go to this type startup startup uh, business we have a startup business group you can rephrase it let's search let's see the list that comes up okay so we have this startup business group we have um, business promotion and development startup you can follow you can follow now one thing you need to know is uh, most of these groups will ask you questions when you want to join you can click to see more and uh, see business startup and development you can follow as many as possible some of them will ask you to this is a page I like US groups or groups where you have uh, US citizens there because they are the ones who will patronize you. They are the ones who are ready to spend for value. Some of these uh, other countries might not be able to pay you to get, uh, that's pay you the actual amount to get that service done. So here we, we actually joined this and this is a page. Let's not look at pages. Okay, let's go for groups. So here we have seven, seven posts a day, meaning that uh, they are not really active as much. This is 34,000 members. This business startup, this is India. There's a small business owners, entrepreneurs. They have over 10 plus posts a day. Well, 584,000 not bad you could join uh business owners entrepreneurs and startup network okay now so most of these pages uh these groups i mean to say not page most of the groups will ask you questions you need to answer i agree to the group rules 
and submit okay um so you can find similar uh groups like this new startup business they have over 10 posts per day you click on this entrepreneurs and business owners community they have over 10 posts per day click to join okay so now nah, huh, they'll ask you a question enter your email below if you'd like to take our free purpose beyond profits blah blah blah, 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 blah. and then here are you willing to join our weekly draw blah, blah, blah. well i'm not ready for this but let me go with this first one let us assume we we can always check out others for yourself you know check out for more groups but this answer the question and i think i am now a member of the group some will take some time before you get a message some it's almost immediately that's if the group admin is online very active so this one says uh, any advice on getting clients i'm a personal trainer with seven years of expertise um mm. now you might just say what business skill do you think they should teach in school uh, people are active here but we've joined okay we've joined already we can now decide to locate members of the group now another thing is you can change your facebook uh, address change it to probably somewhere around the united states you can change it from uh, some other countries you uh, maybe one of these african countries you maybe in nigeria and you can change it to us so you can easily uh, access those who are in us okay you have some upcoming events here you can decide to try one if you want to you know let's look at people okay so this is me who just joined where well, these are the moderators and uh, we have group experts we have members over 548,563 members and uh, we have new people and uh, pages who joined the group access the members of this page all right so we have group contributors we have friends that's those who are your friends who are a member of it so members with things in common here and you can see all now with all this you can decide to start adding friends or sending them a message so let's say you begin to check let's assume that the people here are uh, u.s citizens haven't changed your address your facebook address i don't need to tell you how to do that you should know how to do that um haven't changed your address to us you let's assume that these are us citizens you can now check you can start sending random messages but try not to send your message in a way that it looks like a spam i see some people um drop messages like hi let's say this person is a let's look at uh this lady uche abba say hi uche abba uh check out my uh graphics design uh on fiverr and then they just drop their link now this person might have not heard of the fiverr and doesn't know what fiverr is all about and people don't just click links they, you, even if you say check out this and how to make this or i have an offer for you people don't just click links because um uh, a lot of us are aware already that people you know hack and scam people via links so you have to first you can create a relationship a certain relationship with people create that friendship by you can say hi hi uche uh i'm on cap already so hi uche no need to type because i will not be sending her this message hi uche how are you um i would love to connect with like minds um i am um 
a graphics designer and would love to connect with uh, business minds. Uh, tell me more about your business or this is where you might not start with telling me more about your business. As, uh, you could say, hi, Oche. Okay, let's let's articulate something. Hi, Oche. Um, I am Noel, a member of the small business owners slash entrepreneurs. I love to connect with like minds, people who are business oriented. If you don't mind, I would like us to exchange ideas on how to better our businesses, our individual businesses. For starter, I am a graphics designer, I'm into this, or I'm this, I'm an entrepreneur, I'm blah, blah, blah. And then now, note that not everybody will respond. Some persons will see, see you like, uh, who is this? But if you can message over 20 to 30 to 50 people, at least you should be able to get over 10 response. And from there, you two begin to interact and you share ideas. You have to be smart also. Because before someone will patronize you, the person has to be sure that you're trusted. So you have to be sincere with yourself. Okay? And uh, before you know it, sometimes you could ask, you have issues, challenges with your business? Would you like to share? Let's rub minds together. I love to interact with creative minds. You know? And they're like, oh, how? okay, fine. And before you know it, you're interacting and you're creating that level of friendship. And at the end of the day, you can now tell the person that I can help you in this area. Um, I am a freelancer on Fiverr and uh, I can render so and so service. You know, if it's graphics designer, if it's web website design. And then you can now drop pictures or um, upload pictures of some of the jobs you've done. Or at least by the time you've started com communicating with the person. The person should be able to give you that trust. You can drop pictures. You can even drop screenshots of what you've done and then tell the person to go check out the website. If, if you're a website designer, if you're a graphics designer, the person looks at it and says, yeah, I can actually render this if you wouldn't mind. If you don't mind um, patronizing my service by um, placing an order on my Fiverr account, and if the person doesn't know how to do it, you put the person through and the person learns how to do it. And the person purchases, buys your service, you know. And uh, at the end of the day, you've gotten a client. The person gives you a good review, you see. So that's how it's done. It's very simple. Always look for um, business groups, you know. At the same time, uh, here, these are members of the group, right? You can also scroll and uh, there is an opportunity uh, for you to find uh, new members, members who just joined. It's categorized. Oh, okay, group experts. These are group experts. We have uh, group contributors. These persons are contributors. We have um, friends, people who are friends with you already and then we have members with things in common and you scroll down and you see pages you see new to the group so you see myself i'm new here so those who are new to the group you can send them messages because some of them actually want services they want to rob minds they want to get one or two information or assistance on their business. They want to connect with people. So you can explore by messaging people who are new to the group and get clients to patronize your service. So that's all for this particular video course on using Facebook to get traffic and sales for your Fiverr gig. Don't forget to like, subscribe, click on the notification bell icon to get notified whenever we have a new video. 
See you on the next video course. Thank you.